let's get to the next part of this question and the question says in february his total earnings were 28125 calculate his total sales in february so whatever he had done previously was what had occurred in the month of january so if you come back to this other question whatever is happening is actually in the month of february and you are told that in that month of february as our second month this person had a total of 28125 as his total earnings so we need to first get the commission that he was given and how do you get that one he said total earning total earning should be equal to basic salary plus the commission and from this data we have been given the commission is not known but the salary that the person was receiving was 5000 so we shall say total earning 28125 is the figure here can see it is equivalent to the basic salary 5000 which is actually the one that has been given in this first part of this question then plus the commission C so we shall just take this 5000 on this other side so that our commission is going to be 28125 plus 5000 so our commission is let me pick my calculator so we shall say 28125 less 5,000 that gives us 23,125 that is what this person was given us the commission now we're pretty sure of one commission and that commission is a commission where this person gets given when he makes sales up to or sells worth 200,000 Let's begin from there. We were told that he is given a commission of 5% on sales worth 200,000. So let's first be sure of that commission. Of the sales worth 200,000. That commission is 5%. But the sales above 200,000 is what we cannot calculate. Why? Because we don't know the amount of the total sales. So we shall say first commission 5% of 200,000 correct so we shall say 5 out of 100 multiply by 200,000 200,000 this and this will disappear so that is 5 times 2,000 that gives us 10,000 so the first commission you got was 10,000 but the total amount of money in terms of the commission received is 23,125 so we shall take the total commission 23,125 less the first commission we are sure of which is 5% of 200,000 so minus 10,000 to get the remaining commission that you got on sales above 200,000 so that is going to be 23,125 less 10,000 that gives us 13,125 so the remaining commission is 13,125 this was the commission received on sales above 200,000. So we shall do this. We shall say the commission received on sales above 200,000 is 7.5. So we shall say from this end 7.5 over 100 times x the sales above 200,000. Of which you don't know actually. That's an unknown value. It must be equivalent to the commission, which is now 13,125. The commission received. So it's equal to 1, 3, 1, 2, 5. So you'll just work out for the value of x. 7.5 times x, that is 7.5x over 100 is equal to 13,125. We shall multiply both sides by 100. So times 100, like that. Then times 100. This and this will disappear. We shall have 7.5x is equal to 13,125,00. Zero, zero. 
divide by 7.5, divide by 7.5. Correct. So we want to get the value of x, which will be now the cells above 200,000. So we shall say, let me begin from here. 13, 125, 0, 0, divide by 7.5. That gives us 175,000. 175,000. So the sales above 200,000 was 175,000. So 175,000. Correct. But we had already done 5% of the sales up to 200,000. So the vast amount of money that you received as sales was 200,000. The amount above 200,000 was 175,000. Total sales. We shall say 200,000 plus 175,000. What do we get? So we shall say this 175,000 plus 200,000. So that's 375,000. So 375,000 was the amount of money that the person got from the sales. Correct. Correct. Very good. Very good.